you're now looking at virtual audio cable and virtual audio cable is actually a windows based program that you can download that will allow you to listen to what you are actually hearing on your screen and so what this will do obviously is this will allow you to be able to play back the audio and to be able to use Google Docs. However, the method that we looked at in video number three is more efficient if you can translate it into audio and then have a machine transcription do the audio. However, however, if you're doing a presentation in real time, how would you do it? Well, you would use the Google Docs engine. And basically what this involves is it involves going into Google Docs now you'll need to get an add-on for speech recognition and so one of the things you'll need to do is you'll need to go and get an add-on and the add-on is the same one that was spoken about in the other course but if you type in speech uh, to text then you'll see that this is the engine that you would actually be using and that's the one that's actually installed in Google Docs right now now when we do this we can actually record our video in real time and transcribe it at the same time and actually have something in a document that we will be able to work with and so what we want to do is we want to turn on our transcription and the key to understanding this isn't difficult to do it's to have the presence of mind to actually transcribe in real time now obviously uh, this document that we put together is going to need work we are not going to be able to just look at the document and just have it to work right out of the box. Um, we should really expect that when we get done with the document that we are going to have something that is going to have all the words there but at the same time we're going to need to put it in the form that we want to use in order to sell, put it in the form that we want to use in order to have the book, but it will actually save us a lot of time in terms of actually having to sit down and type or to rethink some of the thoughts that we need in order to have in a book. So the, the, the engine itself uh, really does work just as you're seeing it on the screen. Um, what you'll want to do is work with it so that it will know and kind of understand your voice and understand what it is that you say and understand how it is that you talk. Uh, once again, uh, there are other engines that do this. This is an online engine. It is subject to your internet connection it's subject to a lot of different things because it's on Google Docs um, it's not going to be as reliable as something that you have on your desktop obviously so uh, the other way to do this once again is to use virtual audio cable and that is so that your computer can actually hear the sound and then you can actually use Google Docs in the same way but that's only if you're going to to transcribe a recording once again, the way to transcribe a recording is to turn it to audio and then to use voice base. Okay, so with that, thanks, and I will see you in another video.